the book that I want to talk about is The Midnight Hunt. And this is a new venture for me. This is new territory. And after 35 books, venturing into new territory is really a challenge. Up until now, I know what my books are going to be about, and my readers know what my books are going to be about. Not that every story is the same, but they know me. They know my voice. They know my characters. They know the stories that I tell. And now I'm asking my readers to take an adventure with me. We're going to go down a new path, a very different path. And yet I hope when they get to the end of the journey, they'll realize that we are still traveling together on a path that we're both familiar with, or all familiar with, I guess I should say. So The Midnight Hunt is a paranormal romance urban fantasy series. This is the first book in what I'm calling the Midnight Hunter novels. They're all tied together. They will have the same characters featured in each book, but each book will be a standalone in the sense that there will be a central romance in each book and a continuing story arc that goes throughout the series. And in the first book, we introduce two of the primary characters. The first, uh, her name is Sylvan, Sylvan Mir. And she is the were alpha. She is a wolf were. And essentially what that means is that she's not human. She's never been human. She is a totally different species, a totally different animal, as it were. And she embodies the characteristics of both animals and humans. And she's, a very, she's very much what I consider a Radcliffe character, even though L.L. L. Rand is writing her. She's very brave. She's responsible. She's a pack leader, so she's responsible for her entire pack. She's unmated, which is a problem for many of her uh, pack members because they're concerned that she needs someone to take care of her. So she's very much a lone wolf, and she, of course, is one of the romantic characters. So this is Sylvan's story, and it's also an introduction to the series. So I've written this under a different name. And many people have said, well, you already write under a pseudonym. You write as Radcliffe. Why are you now writing as L.L. L. Rand? And the reason is that this is a very different genre than what I usually write in. Ordinarily, I write romances or romantic intrigue, and I also write a lot of erotica. That's a very specific, those are very specific genres. There are certain reader expectations. They know what they're going to get when they read a Radcliffe romance. I'm asking them to suspend disbelief and accept very different characters. And the way I signal that, or want to signal that, is that this is a different aspect of my writing, so they're going to get a slightly different story. So that's how L.L. Rand came to be. And people said, well, how did you pick that name? And I picked it, number one, because I think it's really cool. And I think it fits an urban fantasy novel series really well. It also will put my books together in a bookstore so that when somebody's going to look for a Radcliffe novel, hopefully they'll see this one and they'll be able to find me together since I'm together.